friends, this is the Miss of Ophi from our Half Acre Homestead with a safety issue. Um, several years ago, I got into a car accident. It was a single car. It was my car. Um, and I ended up in the ditch. And it was a bad hit. I took down a tree before I slingshotted the ass end of my car over the ditch. But um, the car was a total write-off. But one thing that was an issue was my purse flew in the back into the back of the car and the zippers were open and the contents of my purse went everywhere and it led me to thinking how I deal with my cell phone today um, a lot of times people will use their keep their cell phones in their cars at all time for an emergency if anything happens but what happens if you're alone like I was and you end up in the ditch and your purse contents are all over the car. Where is your cell phone? This is my purse. And as you can see, I'm about to drive, so it's all closed up. And this is the pocket that I keep my phone in because it's that's all this pocket is used for is my phone. So I put my phone in here and I zipper it closed and I put my seat belt through the handle. So that my purse stays with me no matter what. And that my phone is always right there, should I need it, in case of an emergency. You can tell my son's been riding with me. He loves Tim Hortons. My point is, is if when you're in an accident, anything not tied down becomes a projectile. Dangerous or otherwise. But if you're trapped, God forbid, you're in a ditch and you're like me, you may not be able to climb out because of your physical limitations. It's really good to have your cell phone within reach and not just within reach, tied down so that it doesn't end up in the back of the car if you're stuck in the front. This is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead saying, just another safety tip. Take care. God bless.